Hello and welcome back again. So today we are looking at the VAS 770T. So these are the extra knee pad. Uh, so on the knee pads there's extra uh, padding on. I don't know if you can see that there. It's just a bit of a blemish there. It's not, um, to be fair, not really what I was expecting to see. Um, but we'll see how we get on with that. See whether it holds out. There does seem to be a... Um, I think it's a double seal or three seals on there, so I don't think we'll have any issues with leakage. Um, just thought that it would have been cut a little bit smoother and a little bit um, neater for VAS. Um, just, uh, yeah, not, not quite impressed with that bit there, but we'll see how we get on and see uh, whether it leaks or anything. You can see there as well, it's, um, it's not been cut very straight, which surprises me quite a lot. Heading down onto the sole section of these low, um, phenomenal sole, really looks good, um, it's got plenty of grip on them by the looks of it, they look like they're going to be a really good boot low, so happy with that, um, as usual them vast boots always seem to have that grip on um, for extra grip and also you can add studs to them as well if you want to, or they do do a studded version that comes with it, or already studded but um, they were not really necessary for the areas that I'm going to fish. Bit of a stain now, I'm not sure what that is. More edges again, um, not very cut, not cut very neatly. Uh, surprises me quite a lot it's the first pair of vast waders i've ever bought um so i mean that might be standard i don't know um i can't see it. it could be purely for the amount of volume that they're getting through these maybe um and it's just being cut quickly and not um being looked at again um and then just chucking it out the door like that i don't know um it's nothing major don't get me wrong it's um but it's just not what i expected to see um on both boots um, bad cutting, bad lines, bad edgings, um, marks on the boots and scuffs and for a brand new set of waders, uh, to be fair I wasn't expecting it, um, yeah so I don't really know what to say about that but I'm just showing you all guys that that's, that's how they come, that's what they look like, they may not be like that on every pair which to be fair they're probably not, I just may be unlucky um, but we'll see, uh, it's not going to affect them I don't think but it's just... Um, it's just something that I'm showing you guys that uh, is present on the ones that I've bought. Let's get that box out of the way. Um, you can see there you've got the extra padding on the knees. Um, which So when you're kneeling down, photos and stuff, it doesn't wear through quickly. Um, but that's the idea. So hopefully that works as well. But from the reports I've had from guys that I know that have got these waders, um, all recommend it to have the extra knee padding um, to make them last longer. Um, so that's the ones that I've gone for with the extra knee padding on there. A nice little touch there as well, the VAS logo um, on the front of it. All this stitching as well seems really, really good. Um, second to none. Um, seems to be all, um, all in order there on the stitching side of it. Um, nice yellow straps as well. I like, I like the braces on, on the VAS waders. Um, they do stand out. You can spot a set of vast waders from a mile away with them straps and the black vas on it. Um, does look good. Also, some uh, little clips here. You can see for clipping anything on, anything you're carrying around with you um, to save you dropping it. Um, also, there's an inside pocket as well. So as you can see there, with a uh, there's a couple of pull cords um, to the side as well to do your trousers up if you want to keep them nice and tight. Um, in case you haven't got a jacket or anything on and it's a bit, uh, the weather's a bit worse for weather. Um, you, you'll see in a second the quick release on the bib, on the brace side of it, um, works really well. Um, seems to not come undone yet. Um, I've only tried it around the house, so hopefully when we're out there, it holds out just as good as it has while I've been trying it on. Um, bear in mind guys, this is just part one. This is a quick look at the waders themselves. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go out, I'm going to give them a try, um, I'm going to get a little bit of footage of me walking around in them um, and just see what I think whilst I've actually got the waders on. Um, so enjoy the what's left of this video guys and I shall speak to you all soon. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button, um, keep up to date with anything else that's going on. Cheers and thanks for watching everyone.